Oh my gosh. I'll take two of those right now. <laughs> Cabin's facing out this way. This is actually pretty darn nice. But more importantly, books. And you have a new book coming out? I do. Uh, 100 Things to Do in Ohio Before You Die. It'll be out next spring. So. Okay. But I will say, I follow you to find out where I should be camping. Because we all like, collaborate yeah. together. Perfect. It's 9.30 on a Saturday night. You are something else. You left your little quarter in there, huh? Uh, it's my donation. <laughs> yeah, okay. Can I pet you? Hi. Alright, you've found your eye. Yeah, I see that. Now we, well, now we really found where we came from. I was trying to do it at great uh, reveal. The great, I already said it. Before. I know you said it. That's what I said. Oh, you said it. That's why I say, oh, big mouth. Said it 11 bucks a pot? I think so. Looks like you're milking a cow. It does. This kind of feels <laughs> gross to be honest. Like I don't like this. <laughs> hey guys, in route with Chuck. Sherry. We are at the wind tunnel. <laughs> we said we wouldn't be back here. We at Evergreen. Yeah. Um, we're giving it another try. The last time we came here, it was like um, 20 degrees out and 100 mile an hour winds. Yeah, I got to so work, so it's yeah, not too far from close. here. And we wanted to do some exploring on Amish country. Because so we were just there because we were looking for peanut butter. Hopefully we were looking for they, peanut butter. We make the same peanut butter <laughs> yeah. as they do with Shipshawana. Yeah, so I don't know, kind of doing something different. Yeah, and we're in here um, in the, I don't know what you call us. Game room, pool area, whatever. Yeah. I got the game on. It's Thursday. Mm -hmm. We're about to watch it. Thursday night football. <laughs> it's all starting. Yeah. Coming back from Cook Forest last week, we got cell service. You know what I mean? I told you, if you watch the video, we were going to be a little, uh, we're going to be glamping. <laughs> so we're glamping this weekend. Yeah. So something different. Two opposite there's ends of a the swimming pool, week, there's yes. a hot tub here. Yeah. <laughs> so it, Kids are already in that hot tub. Yeah, I don't know. They might be too busy, but we came here for that, so we'll see. Yep, she came here for that. She <laughs> drug me along with her. Okay, <laughs> whatever. All right, so it's Thursday night. You'll probably see it tomorrow sometime. Yep. <laughs> Maybe I'll do a little tour of the game room real quick. All right. All right. We made it inside the little game room area. That's something I would not want to see out in the wild. Of course, Chuck's looking at the fish. That's wall I'm out. But look at that. That's always fun. Pool table. What's that thing called? Forget. Air hockey. Fun zone. Vending machine. Nice little area. You can play some games. We're just sitting here and hang out. I guess if you have kiddos, sitting here and watch them play games, but I think we're going to play some games tomorrow. Saturday morning, Buckeyes game day, and this is what you wake up to. Nice view, Amish country, farms, and campers. I'm still uh, trying to figure out how much I really like this place. It's nice, it's really nice, but is this camping? I guess camping's anything you want it to be, but I like trees. I like fishing and uh, exploring. I feel trapped in here, but it's not bad. It's nice. We swam last night. It's a nice place. But yeah, you can see wall to wall. 
campers and this place is packed. I don't think there's a site open, that's for sure. I think they got some big party or something going on at this pavilion. They had a nice fire last night, big group of people. But yeah, it's nice. I'm not gonna down it. It is. It serves its purpose. We're having a good time. That's all that matters. So, we've never been over this area, but it's like got some horses, got a pavilion. You got the cabins over there. I'm going to walk down just a little bit and see what's going. I don't know if that's like a place for you to let your dogs run, maybe. It looks like it does. They got a dog park here. They got the little trail that goes down and around, looks like, I believe. They got a nice bird feeder over there for the cabins. Man. Cabins facing out this way. This is actually pretty darn nice. If you rented the cabin, had a group come back here with that little pavilion area. I wonder if you can rent that. I have to find out. But this is at the far corner before you exit. This is pretty neat. It says putting green. What? Let's see what's going on over here. Putting green. All right. I have never been over here. Yeah, make sure you clean up after your pets. Always. But as you walk across here, again, got a bench. Looks like those are people's homes over there. I don't see no damn putting green. What do they mean putty, putting green? Oh, I think I found it. Yeah, but this is the dog area. Here. Let your pets run. Come back here in the field. Play some ball. And I guess, I guess, this is what they're claiming is a putting green. Here's a better look at the cabins, I guess, maybe. Through there. Oh yeah, it's a putting green. Who would have known? It's turf. And I bet, I'm not gonna say that I would recommend it, but you could probably tee off up there and then putt, this is a little one hole deal. I don't know why they don't advertise it like that. Just put a flag here and a tee box up there and have a, a little part three or something. Nothing wrong with that. But yeah, another nice feature here at Evergreen. This is a, a daily occurrence, multiple times a day, is that we get to a destination and then this lady has to I don't know what the hell she's doing because I have my wallet. Putting yeah, putting your selfie stick on. Oh, you do I don't do the same stuff. I'm always waiting, always just lingering around. I am. So where'd we make it to? The bakery. The Amish Door Bakery. Yeah. And what are we here for? I feel like we're turning into a donut. Look at this. Yeah, hold on. Watch out now. Bam. Look at that. <laughs> okay, so thanks to um, Bob Fish, right? Yeah. With them, them Amish cracked donuts. Right. <laughs> I'm looking for cracked donuts out here. <laughs> and I bet you they don't have them, but we're going to go in here and see what the bakery has to offer. The restaurant's not open. No. What the hell are you rushing for? Why, can't, why are you always moving around? I thought we were going to go taste some. We Taste some. You'll have a half a donut. I know. But yeah, we've been well, doing good, like so. donut person. I am. So. I'd rather have some eggs. I'm going to go in here and see what they got up here in the bakery. I see you already snatched something up. I did. Uh, I'm not, I'm not, again, that peanut butter we got in Chip Shawana. It was, was great. Amazing. And I'm, I'm looking for that too, all the way out in this area. I know, but you don't spend all your money in one place. You got other Blueberry places. Bread. Oh my gosh. Blueberry that does look good. Bread. 
Wow. All right. Let's keep it moving. That's the buttermilk. I told you, and I like, I love cake donuts, called. glazed cake. That's the, the, the buggy something. The buggy ride or something. Yeah. And it has peanut butter. Yeah. And I usually don't do that. She's not going to like it. <laughs> but it's peanut butter and chocolate, and can you go wrong with it? And it had a cute name, which I don't even remember. Mm. Okay. This is a good donut. It's almost like a um, cake. over here running out of the car from a beat. Reminds me of somebody I know. <laughs> mm -hmm. I do it, it when the car is moving. Mm -hmm. Jump right out of the car. <laughs> what do you think? You said it's too sweet. Mm -hmm. Why the hell did you get a donut with all that stuff on there? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you got a nice blueberry donut in there. Mm -hmm. Blueberry cake. This one was good. Now, is it White House Farms? Mm -hmm. Nope. But it's good. White House Farms known for their blueberry donut. So I got the blueberry donut. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now will you just take a bite of each damn donut? <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh, show them. Yeah, blueberry. Mm. <laughs> yeah. It's purple mm. on the inside. That was good. Mm. And I got that. The blueberry That's fry good. pie. It feels heavy. Mm. I'm not sure. Mm. No, I'm not gonna sit here and eat these donuts on camera the mm -hmm. whole time. But I will check back in. Get the blueberry donut. And let you know. But yeah, so far so good. Right. Uh, Amish Door Bakery. I think I'm about to get into a. Ooh, uh, that bee is on you. <laughs> See? Now you talking about mm -hmm. them ladies. <laughs> nope. <laughs> yep, that's what you can get. <laughs> Yellow jacket was on my hand. Yeah. Why are you messing but with I'm, them? But I'm, I'm going back to uh, these apple fritters. <laughs> now, this is a find here. You like apple fritters? Mm -mm. Oh, my. Yeah. The apple fritters, the donut. So if you come to this place, the blueberry was great. If you but come here, I'm, I would go back in there and get a dozen of these apple fritters. Okay. I would. It can cost you though. Yeah, they were expensive ones. Yeah, they were expensive. Apple fritter. Go ahead. All right. All right, come on, let's walk. All right. So what you got? We are at the Harvest Fest. Okay. Kind of just stumbled upon it. Yeah. Um, Ooh. Red cook -off. They go a predator. 3500. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> anyway, we are at Souls Exchange. Okay. I don't know. Is that what it's called? I'm not sure. I don't know where the hell we're going. Yeah, you you dragging me out here and then now we're in a we were in such uh deep traffic. Yes. Can't find parking spot. Um we gotta I, remember where we parked. Yeah, we know where we parked. By the playground. So across some barn and quilts. Alright, let's go walk around see. What are we here for? Anything specific? Oh, so actually are going to hopefully she's still here but brandy gleason from ohio road trips facebook page is, is here signing books so we're gonna go say hi there you go all right, all right. let's go Right, baby, <laughs> I think I found it. found it. What do you think? It's cute, huh? It's cute. I think we should get it. Yeah, what do you think? Well, maybe on the way back, so I don't have to carry it around everywhere. Yeah, but it's the last one, so I don't want, I don't want to make too. sure that don't hide it. I wanted to make sure that everybody's seen the one that I was really looking at. You didn't get the, you didn't get it, huh? I didn't get it. 
I got it. I yeah. got you the shirt that says that. So this shirt. Yeah, Christian lives here with the best catch of his life. Yeah, but me. This is what I was. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. You're see. <laughs> <It's> okay. <laughs> this is my kind of jewelry right here. You like that? Look at that. How long you been doing this? Uh, about 10 o'clock we've been doing this. <laughs> <laughs> you learned, you're a quick, a fast learner. Uh-oh. 22 years. My daughter, well, they've been working with and strollers, so, but the last two years they started making them. Come on, Sherry, why are you walking around? She always moving around. Still moving. You don't have very good camera presence, do you? So as soon as you're on, you're you get to run, and that's all right. Dennis, that is yes. awesome. Thank you, Dennis. Thank you. Look at that. Let me see. Let me see the smile on your face. There you go. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you, sir. All right, so we're in Berlin. We're in Amish country. We see these guys vlogging. What's your channel? What do you do? The Thompson Analysis. We do economic and geopolitical analysis, plus some esoteric items. Yes. We are getting into UFOs and aliens, so if you like that stuff, <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, go grab my channel. We are uh, glad we went, ran into uh, these folks today. We love them right off the bat. Uh, we know they're Cleveland Browns fans. Oh, yeah. That's okay. Don't oh, yeah. Them either way. Good luck, Browns. Go Steelers. Now, listen. I'm a, I'm a children's book author, Christian children's book author. Now, she throws that in there. I hate to cut you off, but she throws that in there because she knows I'm about to be rabid right now oh, when yeah. he's saying, go Steelers, and she's got this garbage on. Our, our followers know how we feel about that. But, no great people but you're 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 yeah, you're an author Brittany the traveling spider okay Brittany the traveling spider goes to France they're both on Amazon and Barnes and Noble so there you go perfect go camping go yes camping. go camping yes, <laughs> see you guys Thank you. so where are we at where are we at so Sherry's mad at me right now <laughs> already done this and Chuck always forgets to hit I forgot record, to hit the record I, I forgot to hit the record I forgot to hit the record but it's the same thing right, let's do this again where are we at and who are we with Brandy Gleason, the famous Brandy Gleason from, uh, see now I lost my train of thought. You Ohio, road Ohio trips. Ohio road trips on Facebook. Yes. <laughs> so that's where we usually find where we're going to go in Ohio and check places okay. out where she actually is in the area where we're camping and was like, hey, we didn't even know about this harvest bus. Seen it on her Facebook and here we are. And, and they got a lot of stuff out here yeah. and they got barbecue, but more importantly, books and yeah. You have a new book coming out? I do. Uh, 100 Things to Do in Ohio Before You Die. It'll be out next spring. So. Okay. But I will say, I follow you to find out where I should be camping. Because we all, like, collaborate yeah. together. Perfect. Absolutely. And she's out here signing books. Yeah. We got our book. We're going to find more places to go. My guy with the chainsaw <laughs> is, just, is just so loud. We almost had a great moment where we didn't have him in the video, but he's still there. Okay. But you guys, go find the books on Amazon okay a lot of stuff in Ohio to do yeah. right and we appreciate your page yeah. and we appreciate your content yeah. and we appreciate your support as well oh, yeah. love you guys yep <laughs> alright alright so that was a nice visit with Brandy it was yeah great to meet her in the flesh we already planning some camping trips together yes. she's a winter camper so and we're, we're gonna be planning some more trips because yes. of the book that we bought Yes. Because it's got a lot of great places in there, I know. Yeah. So that's exciting. So we're about to walk through town, right? We are. We haven't been in this area. We, uh, I don't we've remember. We've driven through the area. We've driven through here, we've but never kind of walked around. So we're going to go check out this fall fest. We're on foot patrol. Maybe have some ribs. Maybe get ran over. We are going to have <laughs> some ribs. We are not yeah. going to get run over. I've seen a Michigan fan. <laughs> Slapped him on his back. He did. Okay. The dude turned around and was like, what are you doing? I don't care about nothing. Gosh. Okay, we up 21-7. <laughs> it's uh, Youngstown State, but it's okay. Yeah, I mean, we figured that was going to happen. Yeah, so we're going to walk up the road, see what some of these stores have to offer, and definitely get some food. All right. But this is, this is happening right now. I mean, look at... It's happening. So it's it, a barbecue. The oh, cook off. One of them right, here. right over there. But I see they have some mac and cheese, and that's my thing. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, I'm mac and cheese. <laughs> it's a line over there. You want to go get a rib or something? I'm gonna get some mac and cheese. No, no, no. Well, we listen. No. Are you are you ready to eat? I'm always ready to eat. <laughs> All right, let's go. In, let's cross it, and we'll just go. Okay. We just gonna grab a. I'm gonna get a rib bone and see what we can do All from right, we there. Gotta go to the light. Okay. Look what I ran into here. How many slabs we got here? We're doing, uh, we can pass these about 200 over. 200 slabs in there? Man, spare ribs, obviously. Yeah. Looking fantastic. I'm sure with your own personal rub on there, sauce if you need it, right? Sure. Those all ready to go? Yep. Oh my gosh. I'll take two of those right now. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Cher, where we at? We have the After Hours Barbecue. Yeah. They're out of Orville, Ohio. And they got a, a huge sign. Those guys over there, Pitmaster, I was just over there yeah, looking at the ribs. Yeah, they were, and they look delicious. Right? But I love, I love some size. I'm a size girl. So what so are you like, looking at? I see all kind of size. Yeah, but we can't them. have all that I stuff. I know. But I, see, I mean, obviously, I'm mac and cheese. I got the loaded barbecue nachos. And look at this cornbread with pork beans and nacho cheese Sunday. Yeah. Daddy's yeah, a little bit of everything, yeah. right? So, but we're gonna have to, we're gonna try to test test them out. Uh, yes. Oh, well, other places, so we can't get full, I guess. That's right. Oh, we're gonna be full. <laughs> it's <laughs> off the diet today. <laughs> All right, after hours barbecue. Let's see what they got to offer. But the ribs did look fantastic. They did look delicious. <laughs> he said like 50 racks. Oh my god. Yes. Look at that setup. Yeah. I need one of those. Yeah, you do. <laughs> <laughs> yep. The ribs look fantastic. They really do. What you got? Let me see. I'm doing the mac and cheese review. All right, go ahead. <laughs> mac and cheese. Let me get a bite of that. So. Just a little bite. That's perfect. What do you think? That ain't bad. It's mac and cheese. Good. Um, right? You can get full. You can get filled up on mac and cheese, and it's a barbecue event. You know what I mean? Um, mac and I mean that is crazy. Okay, mm. but they do got the line going out the door. All right. It hasn't stopped since we got here. Nope. And they were quick with their service. We got more to go, so let's. Do All right. This. Dang. Wrap this up. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Chuck's. You got sauce mm -hmm. all over you, but that's all good. You're eating ribs, so you're allowed. Mm -hmm. And I just think it posted something like it don't cost anything to uh, chew with your mouth closed. <laughs> but I think we do that a lot, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so you're pretty picky about your ribs. And um, what you think? I think they're good. They're good. Um, Ohio's best. I made some better in my backyard last week. Now, now listen, now wait a he minute. He does, he, but maybe they're- Now wait a minute. These are good though. Oh, Nothing man. wrong with these ribs. No, they melt, they melt right off the bone. You said you were looking for some more smoke. No? Nobody says melt right off the bone when you talk about ribs. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, what do you say? You come clean off the bone. There you go. But yeah. Oh, we gotta they're get good. away from here. There's they're bees good. all over the place with this lemonade. Mm -hmm. All right. So. That's she over here complaining to me again. Traffic, you, just you can do whatever you want. So, as we were here, uh -huh. and I see across the other side of the street. Oh, yeah. Apparel outlet. <laughs> now we got to go back across the street again. I right. said, man, oh man, oh man. Okay. It's a busy street though. Right? Got balloons happening. People happening. What's going on down here, isn't it? Yeah. All right, just to give you an idea where we are, we're on the corner of... 39 and 62. Yeah, which is Main Street. Yeah. And they have all these cute little shops they down do. this road that we never even knew about. Um, I think we drove past most of these. Yeah, but we never we walked it. The bigger. We never walked mm -hmm. it. But like antiques and like and all like fall decor, which I love. It looks like they got some new spaces in here as well. Yeah. to eat and things like that. But yeah, Mojo's is right across this way. That's where we're headed right now. Last year's winter. Yep, we'll see about and I'm this. About to, I'm about to go get some. Better <laughs> hurry. Better hurry. So we're at Mojo's. Uh, I'm getting ribs. Ooh, okay. Are there you go running crazy. again. Um, okay. So I was looking to see if they had like a, just a grizzly. I 
I just want a bite of brisket. Yeah, you can't get a bite of brisket. You got to get a whole thing of brisket. Yeah, I'm going to just go with the mac and cheese again, I guess. No, you're, there's no way. We're not buying mac and Let's cheese again. Let's get a mac bowl. We're not buying mac and cheese. You're going to get you some uh, a fill <laughs> okay. of either some ribs or some brisket. You take I your choice. Oh my gosh. They have brisket and mackerel. Okay, we'll get you that. Yeah. Yep. So she wants the brisket and mackerel. And I'm getting the ribs. You said what? It could change by then. Yeah. So, looks like you're milking a cow. It does. This kind of feels gross to be honest. It does. Like I don't like this. It feels weird. Huh? It feels weird. I'm not even doing it. It just looks weird. Yeah. <laughs> Trying them all. Yeah. They look good, they smell good, so yeah. let's go taste some. I don't know what that is, yeah. but it's dark. Hopefully, right. it's hot. Hurt, they found some shade. <laughs> we did. So, the last time, these bees are all over the damn place. They are bad right now. But the last barbecue spot, it wasn't bad. Like yeah. I said, it was good. Uh, I was looking for a little bit more smoke. Okay. So, this is the one that won last year. Yeah, and I'm going to I think they're here. from Southeast Kentucky. What did yeah. it say? Southeast uh -huh. Kentucky. <laughs> What? We'll be back. Stay tuned. <laughs> I was trying to get my. I know. Um... You ready? <laughs> you ready yet? Mm hmm. You think they. They're not bad. Wow. No, I didn't say they were. None of them. Because I think, like, you have. None of them. Your favorite already. I do. And there's a German short hair pointer right there. Oh my God! Look at that guy. All right. And I was we'll just telling Sherry for that. <laughs> no, when I get in the I want to yeah, go by. Yeah, he did. Look he showed me a guy. picture. Anyway. Wait, zoom in on Brett. This guy. Oh when you my see gosh, him. Charles! Really? Look I don't even. Guy. I can't see. Yeah, zoom in on that guy. Look at that little guy. Look at that. Okay. All right. You're lucky I'm over here. I'll be all over that dog right Back now. to a uh, regular scheduled program here. Yeah. So no. The ribs ain't bad. Okay, it's just not bad. Award-winning? So, Award-winning? Maybe I make award-winning ribs. You do, though, so I, I think know. we've had some pretty good ribs. They're good. So we're picky. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I'm even pickier because I usually like my brisket over ribs. But. That's right. All right. My turn. You just ain't coping this. For me. I usually like my food separated. Right. I would so, put some barbecue sauce on that bad boy. You know what? Okay. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. But I am going to taste it without it because I like doing that anyway. Yeah. Give me a bite but, of that brisket. Yeah. Mm. Give me a bite of that brisket. That's perfect. You ain't got to hold it. Yeah. Mm. Mm. I always got a question mm. why people chop their brisket mm. up mm. and they got it on the, the photo sliced. I do like it sliced. I want sliced brisket. I do like it sliced, but... It's got good flavor. This is great. What are you talking about? This has got good flavor. I'm not excited about it. No, not at all. Mm. I, I like really the good. ribs. I like ribs. That's mm -hmm. what I'm a, I'm a rib guy. Okay. But yeah, that don't look bad. Mm. Your big mouth. Mm -hmm. You gonna put you some sauce in there or no? Mac and cheese. How's the cheese? Mac and cheese. They covering it up with brisket, huh? A fan, but okay. brisket, yes. And those aren't it's the same. Wedding. Those aren't the same shells they showed in the picture either. You know what? Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> They're not cheesy. I don't know. I'm really. Picky. It's hard to cook for the masses. That's but, the problem. But the brisket is it's on point. All right. All right. And I'm gonna eat mine. Okay, we're stuffed. Yes, stuffed. It was hey, good. the barbecue was good. Yeah. Both places. Nice job. Yeah, we can't make it. There's probably, I don't know, how many places you think we only so made it to two. Bunch. Yeah, I can't get I can't eat no more and it costs too damn much. But yeah, I do make some pretty good barbecue. One of these yeah, days I'll bring he a does. smoker out to the to the campground. <laughs> Pass get some ribs around. Going, get some slabs. We going. could sell them. We're gonna sell them. No. 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 But um but yeah, what is it? Yeah, Park Link is out in an area. Cool little festival, huh? It is. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, walking the town, there's a whole bunch of people down here. I know. It's I like so many vendors. Yeah. But. Smells great all through the freaking city. Yeah. I need to give me some yeah. dessert though. He's Even a sweet I person. <laughs> I know. Our daughter's calling. She's I'm gonna get some. Daughter's uh, facetiming us right now. I'm getting some ice cream. That's what I'm getting. Okay. I like ice cream. All right. Off to the camp. Store. All right.
Uh oh, she's confused. We got her. So, where are we where are we at? Blessings Acres. Per recommendation of Brandy, Lisa, with Ohio Road Trips. And so we were at the um, book signing she was at in the festival, and they had these large pots of mums that were multicolored, yeah. and I believe they were $22 like a piece. 23, between 23 and 25 And that was, a to us, is a great From deal. Our, like, our, ours is so expensive. They're so expensive that they're almost unaffordable. So... As, she recommended us to come here. And then I said, well, I hope these uh, these better be cheaper. Or Sherry, gonna be, somebody could be mad, mad, mad. They are cheaper. Oh, my gosh. Right there. Look at all this. So these mums, in retrospect, go ahead. You can see these are large pots and they're hanging over. Stan, put your hand in front of one of them things. And, okay, they haven't bloomed yet, but these things will be blooming. They're large pots. They're and some are already bloomed. Yeah. Oh, Miss Big Mouth. But I want to get some. Oh, Miss Big Mouth. I was trying to do the great uh, reveal. The great, I already said it. I know you said it. That's why I say, oh, Big Mouth. I said it 11 bucks a pot? And then even these large ones here, which again, these mums, will, they're going to uh, bloom. But these large ones here with everything in it, okay? Large ones. Those are 28 bucks. Look how big the, the pots are on these things. Yeah. These are large mum planters 28 bucks look at the look at the planter in the pot that you get with these things these are amazing i am because i'm so all in the gonna find room to put this yeah we camper. was over there making fun of the guy at uh yeah. at the campground watering his water moms. he over there watering his moms and here i'm gonna be <laughs> watering moms <laughs> she gonna be watering moms <laughs> yeah. okay. all right okay. so we're at lehman's okay our hardware store uh, no, good. they have furniture yeah, and know. it's a whole bunch of different stuff. Um, Amish made, obviously. Rich, thank you for the recommendation. Well, maybe not thank you yet. I'll tell you later if I yes. like it. Uh, Buckeyes won 35-7, 2 and 0. You know how we do. Mm -hmm. But we're going to go in here and check it out. Never been here. Let's see what they got to offer. Right. Where you headed, lady? I don't know. We're going back in this way. Are we going in here? Yeah, we are. So right away as we walk in, I saw and spotted some stuff. And she says, well, what is it? And I said it. I said it's art. It's carving black. Carving black. Yeah. So, look at this. This is very detailed. This is a wood carving. This is all detailed, and and I mean, I if you can touch. see, I just touched it. It said do not touch, but you can see. Look at that. This is crazy. Like this. That's some real talent. Mm -hmm. This is a wood carving, and it looks like a picture. Very cool. Look at these. What's the price on some of these? You got the price on here? Are they for sale? Yeah, big sign, do not touch. I didn't see that to begin with. I'm sorry. Signs all over, do not touch. This one's even got a light on the inside of it. Now that is some craftsmanship. So they have all kinds of offerings. From greeting cards to games puzzles. to puzzles, art, Books. furniture, tools, restrooms. restrooms, you name it. Yeah. We'll keep looking. They have a What's that? They have a yes. Wanted posters, cookbooks. Yeah, they were back there. Yeah. See any candy you like? They could they could get rid of these. And it wouldn't bother anybody in the world. No, I bet you those are out of date because nobody grabs those. Black licorice? No way, Jose. Oh, look at this. Back into some games. I bet you some of these are uh, vintage, huh? Yeah, skip along. That's you. I could see you out there. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah, here she goes. She's like she got some roller skates and almost broke her butt. So this place has, I mean, this is, it is a little overwhelming, as much stuff as they have. You don't know what to uh, look for, so much damn stuff. But it's pretty cool. All right, you found your aisle, now I see. We, now, we, now we really found what we came here for. Yeah, they got a the whole bunch of, 
Yeah. That looks like it's really nice and seasoned. The black lock series, huh? Mm-hmm. Let's see. Double Dutch oven. We were looking for that pizza cooker. I know. Uh, when we were yeah. at uh, Korea. Jefferson? Jefferson? Yeah. Girls, they had the pizza cooker. Oh, reset cool. it. Maybe press uh, away. Yeah. All right. All right, you find anything? Nothing. Nothing? Nothing. Nothing. Well, that's this is it. a waffle maker. And that's pretty cool. It's almost like a pie iron. Yeah. Make you some waffles. Mm -hmm. Pour them in there. That's not a bad idea, huh? What do you think? No? It's nice. I would have waffles in a minute. Yeah, but it's not large. Oh, it isn't? No. Oh. Sugar Creek Supplier. Remember Are that? you sure? Because it's all in the lodge section. I know, it is. But what does huh. that say on there? Okay. What does this label say? Yeah. You always question it if I'm sure oh, about some all stuff. Alright. Keep it moving. It's a big store <laughs> to it, get through. Uh-oh. You know how to use that thing? Wait, this has been restored. She said it works. It definitely don't work. Let me see. Yeah, make a call then. Yeah, see, that's supposed to be rotary. Mm-hmm. And calling hey, nobody. Yeah, okay. Now, how do you... I don't have 10 cents. I gave my 10 cents to, uh, I donated our change. Let's see. She's really going, she's really going through with this. This is a deposit. Yeah. 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 Now the 25 cents is stuck in there forever. Yeah. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a yeah, sure. Yep. Here we go. Yeah, this doesn't work. No, uh -uh. I just leave her be. You'll never get her out. You might put her back. John's going to have to uh, redo it again. Say hello. <laughs> I don't, need to, I don't need to do that. Get out of here. Do they see the dial tone? <laughs> You're the dial tone. Okay, take picture. <laughs> Go ahead. You're a big goof. Oh, the door shut? I can't see you. You are something else. Okay. You left your little quarter in there, huh? I know. Maybe it's my donation. <laughs> yeah, okay. Someone will find it. Well, that was something. That was a cool store. It was a little like, throwback a in lot time. Of antiques and everything. So make sure you look up because a lot of stuff's up high. Yes. And we were told um, that this store was created to uh, supply goods for the Amish originally. Yes. And um, oil lamps and things of that nature. And then it just kept evolving into what it is today. So yeah, I yep. mean, make sure you make some time for it because it's a lot. There is a lot. <laughs> it's a here. lot to look at, lot to see. But, but um, good stuff. Cool stuff. Yep. yep. This may be the last stop. We're tired. We're, we're, I'm yeah, exhausted. Uh, Schistler's. Schistler's Cheese House. Yes. We want to pick up some cheese while we're out here. We always love to do that and head back to the campground. We didn't make it to Troyer. We, we did not. Yeah, we ran out of time. We ran out of time. We did. Yeah, stuff started to close. <laughs> Start. We ran out of time. We ran out of time. Okay. But yeah, so we're going to go in here and see what they have to offer. Yeah. And then we're going to head back to the campground. Give me a nice a, uh, uh, fire and get off my feet. Yeah. It's a small little store in here, but it has a lot of cheese in here. Your choices. So, I think it's close to where we were, yeah. so it's a quick little stop. Yeah. Nope, that's it. That's it? Okay, I'll take you over there to the register. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we're going to head back to the campground. So here we are at Evergreen. It's 9.30 on a Saturday night, and we are the, literally the only ones in this place right now. With the pool and the hot tub, we got it all to ourselves. And the campground's packed. 
Yeah. Right? It's crazy. It is crazy. And last night there was only a few people in here mm -hmm. at this time. Yeah. So if you're at Evergreen, make sure you do your camping, have your fire, have your dinner, and then when you want to go to pool time or hot tub time, make it nine o'clock <laughs> and you yeah. have it all to yourself. For real. <laughs> Sunday morning, people pulling out. Uh, Sherry's still moving around, trying to get up. No coffee yet, but I did eat that blueberry fry pie from the Amish door. It was pretty damn good. It wasn't like the ones that we had, uh, I can't remember the name of that place, the world's best fry pies. Those were 100% the world's best. But this was a close second. Real blueberries in there, tasted fresh better than most uh, fry pies we have. So, be packing up here soon and going home. Take a look at this. This is what I want y'all to see. This is what I want y'all to see. Look at this. Not only is this thing haul bikes, but it can haul flowers too. <laughs> That's how many damn mums and stuff she picked up yesterday. But yard will look good once we go home. All right, then. All right. That was fun. It was fun. Different for yep. us, but. It grew on us. Yeah, we, um, I mean, I, I don't mind this place. No, not it at all. It's nice. Um, and we kind of gave it a bad rap, but it's being able to go to the pool, using the hot situation. tub, it was good. It was nice. Um, if you want to be a uh, not as crowded, you go a little later. That way, you know, there was only a few people there. Yeah. And we went at like nine o'clock. Um, Yesterday we went at eight and there was no, we were by ourselves. Yeah, they got cable hookup, which I didn't see. Cause she hooked the power up and I was fighting, trying to get some TV all week to yeah. watch some games. And here they got cable I mean, hookup. Now she tells me when it's over. They got, they've got a lot of amenities here. They do, I mean, they do. It's glamping. Yes, in the area, Amish country, a lot to do, yeah. a lot to see. We didn't get the chance to see everything. We but we got to explore some. We did. Met but some nice we people. We didn't have a lot of time. We did. Not enough time. But yeah. Um, um, Wendy and Suzanne. Nice meeting you guys. Yeah. Um, who else? Brandy Gleason. Yes. Awesome meeting you. <laughs> Finally got a chance to meet you. Uh, actually bumped into her while we were picking up mums. She told yeah. us to get the mums. Yeah, and we were there. And next thing you know, she comes strolling yep. in. Yep. But uh, trip in the future is planned. Yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. Winter camping. <laughs> yep. Uh, donuts was okay. You know, the pastries were good. Well, we have I a favorite that, donut place, so it's hard to compare. It is. I but ate, they were good. I ate that blueberry uh, fry pie this morning. How was that? I already gave my review. Oh, okay. It was good. It was good. It wasn't the world's best. Yeah. No, but it was It was good. Appreciated it. It was fresh. Um, I mean, it, 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 again, this place, there's cabins here. And this is um, a nice site because of the views. Okay, I already said that. Yeah. But yeah, the views are nicer because we're at the at the end, I guess. Yeah. Um. But yeah, so if you don't have a camper, there's cabins. Mm -hmm. Um. And I think there's like some pretty nice lodges and stuff in that area. There is. Inns. Um. Amish country has a lot to offer. Mm -hmm. A lot of cabins in the area. Yeah. Um, I think the treehouse cabins aren't too, too far from this area as well. Yeah, I'd like to do that sometime. Yeah, just a lot to do. So, no fishing, no kayaking, we no hiking. We didn't even cook this weekend. I didn't even cook. This is this the first, is the first time, time I did not cook. probably cooking. ever camping. I think ever that I did not He's, cook this weekend. Yeah, I, I gave him a break. She did. But it, it was, was worth it. it was I mean, nice. ribs were good. Barbecue was good. The atmosphere yeah. was great. So, yeah. made up for it. It was fun. But, but. all right. We're I off. Think that's it. Yep. Till next time. Safe travels.